win tonight. Uh, you guys getting third seed. How did it feel to score a couple goals there in the end? Uh, time spent. Yeah, it was nice with a little relief, I guess. Um, I had one earlier in the game that almost went in. I was kind of kicking myself after that one, but um, it's always nice to score, and especially now. You know, with a couple injuries now, everyone's got to contribute and step up their game. And um, I think it's just good, you know, last game of the season, kind of get a little momentum moving forward. Uh, you know, now it's going to count. So, you know. I thought your second one that maybe it was Matt Ronan's goal at first. I know. I, I was just saying uh, I would not give it to him gladly if I could. Uh, <laughs> maybe I shouldn't have tipped it, but um, I was real happy for him. Uh, I've roomed with him for three years now, and, you know, just the way he comes to the rink every day with a positive attitude. And, how hard he works. Um, I couldn't have been happier for him. And like I said, I know, I know him real well and I was real happy. And I think the first person I pointed to was him because, you know, it was awesome. I thought. So. How nice is it that Ronin gets his first career point the night after Moscatel gets his first career point? Yeah, it's pretty uh, pretty cool. They're real close to those two. So um, that's awesome when you see guys like that that get a chance to, uh, to play. And, they're all, you know, they're, they're good players, and you know they got their chance, and they're making the most of it. So, um, you know, we're going to need a little more of that too going forward with uh, the depth. We're taking a little hit you know, uh, with a couple injuries. Um, I think it's good for those guys to get in there and, and get some bumps, and you know, get a goal or get a point, and just kind of, you know, get a little confidence. You know, they haven't played uh, a whole lot in the last few years, and they're good players. And you know, I think confidence is a big thing going forward. So I think that's. That's good for them. Everyone's happy for those guys. You know, you see the bench probably get uh, more excited for those two getting a point or a goal than, than anyone else. So it means a lot to uh, to our team, and I think it means a lot to them too. You haven't had the greatest season points wise. So, how big of a confidence boost is it for you to have two goals heading into the postseason? Yeah, um, I think I said this earlier. I wanted to just you know focus on playing the right way, and uh, the points haven't been coming, but uh, it can get frustrating at times. But um, you don't want to be a, a distraction that way. Um, you want to keep playing hard. You want to, don't want to be a liability. And, um, you know, the, the quote I like to, to refer to is, if you're not, if it's not working, you're not working hard enough. So, um, you know, I think after the Vermont game, uh, me and coach kind of had a conversation. I don't think he was happy with my effort. And, um, I agreed with him, and that's just something that I kind of wanted to go uh, in these two games this weekend. Was just you know really focused on working hard first, and you know not worrying about the points, and you know sometimes it. Just the way it goes, they take care of themselves if you, uh, if you were uh, focused on playing the right way. So um, you know, I was probably as relieved as, as anyone could be. But um, I think you know, getting a shutout for uh, for Sean and um, getting a win for our team and getting that third place is, is even more important. How different is it now knowing that Sean is pretty much the guy going forward and for him to get a shutout tonight as well? Yeah, um, obviously with Matt going down, it's a very unfortunate situation. We're all we're all with him there and. Uh, we can't really change anything about that. So uh, we have confidence in either guy that was playing, and um, you know now we know it's Sean that's that's going to be going forward, and um, we believe in him just like we would in Matt. And I think it's he played this weekend and showed how good of a goal he is, and um, you know that you know with the little, with, with the confidence he's playing with right now, that's an important time to, to have that kind of uh, that confidence. Uh, you know, getting a shutout last game of the season, especially as a freshman goaltender I know I'm sure there's a lot of nerves that go with that position so um, you know it's nice to see guys blocking shots with a minute left two minutes left uh, for uh, to get that shutout for him and uh, you know for him going forward that's that's probably huge and what do you think was the biggest difference between the way you guys played Northeastern this weekend compared to the two losses you had to them earlier this season um, I think we played more of a team game I think um, you know, at times this year, we had a you know a tough streak after Christmas. I think um, maybe guys were uh, you know maybe pulling in different directions, or you know everyone thought it had to be them, or or uh, you know it was one individual that was going to get us a win. But uh, I think the best that we play is when we're as a team. And I think uh, you know tonight and this weekend, you saw a lot of good puck movement. Before there's probably a lot more you know individuals carrying the puck or, or this and that. And I think. Uh, you know, you saw a lot more shots blocked, um, you know, a lot more commitment to defense. I think that's a big key for us is, you know, we can't let in five and six goals and expect to, to win a game. Um, and I thought uh, a big thing for us tonight was not letting them come back in the game and, and uh, getting that shutout, which is we've had a little trouble with that uh, with teams coming back late in games. And I thought that was real, real big for us to, uh, to finish that game out strong. Obviously, you guys 
Yeah, um, they're they're a special group of guys. You know, I think anytime uh, it, senior class is, is always going to be special, but I think they're uh, um, you know the first class not to win a beat pot. And you know, I think a lot of people put a lot of emphasis on that, and I think they're you know a, a strong group of guys uh, character wise that probably took that to heart. You know, you saw a couple of guys shed some tears after that. And, um, you know that that really speaks to a lot of guys' uh, character, and it also spoke to a bunch of us that uh, you see that, you see how much they care, you see how much that they're willing to put, uh, you know, their body and their their game on the line uh, for this team. And I think um, you know, winning four of the last five here is kind of a, a testament to kind of how our teams progressed. You know, we we had that adversity going through, and I think uh, you know, kind of with that those bean pot losses, it, it kind of helped us uh, refocus and. And just kind of remember that we're playing for each other, and I think it starts with those guys. You want to play for them because you know, this is their last kick in the can, and um, you know you want you want them to go out the right way, and they want to go out the right way. So um, that's I think that's what it comes down to. Is just uh, you see that effort kind of getting raised up, and I think it starts with them. Was well, anyone aware of all the different scoreboard watching going on in the bench during the game? Uh, we guys just kind of focused on your own. Uh, I didn't hear anything during the game. Uh, as soon as we stepped off, though, everyone was kind of updating everyone with, with what they thought or what they what they knew. So I think uh, probably five minutes after we got off the ice, uh, after the senior stuff, we found out that we we're, were in third playing Merrimack. So, um, you know, it's nice to know now where we finished third place is uh, you'd probably take it if you were a month ago and you were a BU hockey team, the way we were playing. So, um, you know, it's this is where it counts. There's, when you're in, you're, you lose your out. So, um, good, good finish to the season. But that's that's all it is. It's you know time to uh, to kick it up a notch and make it count. Great. Thanks.